Hey there, everybody. So, today's January 10th, and um, this is episode two of our lovely <laughs> bitch fest, I would imagine this is going to be, because uh, oh, I got to cover some stuff like, you know, Legacy Body Sucks, because you can't seem to buy any, get any clothes for it. Without, don't look like shit, or look super flamboyant. Or fucking hair. I mean, I like the look ahead, but, you know, the body, getting clothes for it, I want a pain in the ass. You know, what well, it is. It's a pain in the ass to try to find the right shit. And, um, yeah, then I want to get on to the whole poaching situation that I found out tonight. <sighs> Fuck me running, huh? Uh, now I sound like you. Yep. Yeah, you do. You're picking up my words. Woohoo! Oh, don't get excited on that. <laughs> It's just an interesting play. It's just an interesting bunch of words, but yeah. So, what's your take on this whole poaching debacle? I mean, it is kind of a crappy thing, but um, it's like I told somebody that uh, I am not gonna even <laughs> entertain that kind of idea with that shit place that we went to tonight. No, the place was super old school. Oh my god! It was in in a newer building. I don't know if you camped outside of it. But I d- it was in a I newer did. Building and the building looked, you know, decent, but then they just trashed it with so much old looking shit and just so much shit. Period. It's just too busy in there. It's just too busy. The shoutcast board didn't work. Um, the DJ was up and down with the music, but uh, yeah. Yeah, there was no flow, but I guess he was on trial or something. And well, it doesn't matter. I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have hired him. Yeah, well. Said, Try again. Desperation, you know, desperation. Yeah. Gotta gotta well, get I DJs that are known for, like like myself, who people are gonna, you know, yeah. gravitate to. It's not the first time it's happened to me, and it probably won't be the last. Right. You well, know? and like we were talking beforehand, you know, my. Main issue, well, the whole, the whole entire situation was hinky, but the whole TP and only TPing you when you know, when the person knows that you and I work together yeah. everywhere. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. not a, not a single TP and I am nothing from this person. And I, I had been online for hours today. Yeah. No, just grab me as soon as I log in. Yep. Yeah, uh, just very suspicious. I don't know. I hate the cold TPs. And of course, since I brought you over there, there was really nothing much said. Right, exactly. I kind of wonder what would have been said if I hadn't come over with Right. You. It was just like, okay, so I have fans, but yet they're not vocal because you're around? Oh, well, yeah, because I got the hots for you, and I'm just in the room. <laughs> yeah, well... I'm sorry, but there's more to this voice than just uh, the voice. You know, you can you can love it up all you want, but um, I talk like this normally. So, it's, as you know, I talk like this normal. This is my normal. This is my normal voice. I don't. I only amp it up when I DJ, but normal. Normal. Other than that, as you know, I'm just talky talky myself. Self. You know, <laughs> stop your giggling. <laughs> Oh, brother, you. Yeah, not to mention when you throw in, you know, your Matthew McConaughey or um, you working at a gas station. Gas station? Yeah. It, do you want me to explain that one? Uh, well, this is it, it. All right, all right, all right. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> explain the gas station thing. I don't remember where I heard this. I think this was one of my last real life jobs when you were describing an Indian. You know, if it was Native American, it was feather, not dot. And if it was the other way around, it was dot, not feather. And when you dot, dot, feather? That's a that's a weird thing. Yeah, dot, not feather. I know it sounds horrible and, you know, probably it does. racist and everything. But I don't know. It, you know what else you need to explain? Um, I don't know if this will get, but you know, the whole, the whole thing oh, you were trying to. Oh, the other night when we 
went over to one of the clubs that we work at. Yeah. Yeah, and you were trying yeah. to get that out on air. And I think this is probably the best. You know, if somebody needs an explanation, you could share this video with them, and they can get an explanation on that. True, I could. Um, so, yeah, we were um, talking at the other club. We were just hanging out um, about how I am 34, and JH is... Old enough to be my dad, technically. Uh, I probably and could be if I actually, you know, if, I mean, if let's see. Some societies even old enough to be my grandpa, but we won't push that because that's just oh, creepy. That is wrong. <laughs> that is so wrong. But the DJ had made mention that generally younger girls chasing after older men are either gold diggers or they have daddy issues. And so, what do you? There was also conversation about what do you call an older man that chases younger women, versus like a cougar chasing an a, a older woman chasing younger men. So Google to the rescue. So for a man that is older chasing younger women, they are called a manther. So take out the P from panther and put an M as in Mary. Um. Or, then J.H. asked me, well, what do you call the girls that chase after and pursue older men? And that is a panther. Or, another listing under Google was an average woman. I don't know how that's an average woman. I don't know. I mean, I could see I, that in some cultures that's maybe an average woman thing, but it's, I don't know. I don't know. I died reading that. That was hilarious. Uh, you know, it, it, it is pretty funny. So, yeah, but I'm sure that uh, that was the biggest explanation that we had to come across that everybody wanted to know, which was kind of interesting. So, yep. yeah. So, there you go. If you were ever wondering, there you go. Older men chasing younger women are manthers, and younger women chasing older men are panthers or average women. <laughs> average women. Yes. Uh, Okay, then. That's interesting. Yeah. Well, I can't say you're chasing after your dad because I'm not your dad. No, thank God. <laughs> no. no, that's a whole mess of narcissism that I really try to avoid as much as possible. Okay, so moving on, what else is there that we were going to discuss? Hopefully you're keeping well, notes. You had mentioned the legacy body going over that first, but you kind of... Well, I guess you kind of bulldozed that one a little bit, too. Well, it was just a bitch because I just, you know, the legacy body is a nice body and all, but uh, I want to find some fucking decent clothes. Yes, and some that are for straight men would be wonderful. That's just the same situation that you ran into with the Naramith aesthetic body is there was no clothes unless you were... Flamboyant, flamboyant or gay. There's yeah, and that's that's why a lot of people went away from the uh, aesthetic body because of that. Yep. You know, and, and I really didn't want to get rid of it because there was a lot of clothes that were decent. And um, now you're starting to find more people making clothes for aesthetic. And not that I would buy any of them, but, you know. Yeah, I, I kind of like the shape that you're at now. I am too. And, you know, it took a lot of work to get to this point. Maybe the next thing I can work on is some hair. You know. If you weren't so picky on hair. Well, you know I am. And I mean, you like looking like you're from the Bee Gees. Uh, 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 staying alive, staying alive. Okay, we'll get, move on from that. Also, with your, with your hair, like I've made mention when we've been working, is that it's to cover the flat spot on the back of your head. Oh, for shut me up. slapping you or <laughs> one of our other managers slapping you on the back of the head. Or oh, the owner. Or the owner. Yes, yeah. she started doing that, too. She's yeah. She's kind of jumped on the bandwagon with that one. Yeah, oh, she loves it. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Okay. Do you want to get into aliens? I really don't. No. Uh, but it is funny. Mm. We don't have to talk about it. I just wanted to mention it. That was all. No, but I do believe in aliens because that would be really sad if we were the only, you know. Well, I agree. 
species in the universe. I agree. Just like ghosts. I believe in ghosts. Yes, just, I just, do too. just like I have a. <laughs> and you were so worried about background noise. You hear him. And now, now you have your little furry buddy trying to join in on the conversation. Do you have something to say? Besides that. Dad, no. your hair sucks. Especially when you go blonde. <laughs> I could go back to blonde if you want. No. <laughs> See, even he agrees. It sucks. It looks horrible. All right, turn around. Tell him. Shut up, you. Hey, I get rid of him. <laughs> oh, you got rid of him. Aww. For for now. For now. For now. I mean, I don't know what he's meowing about. I have to check that out and see. It's probably something to do with the kid. But yeah. All right, so where else are we going to go here? Uh, what else has gone on the last week besides me working? And, uh, yeah. Uh, Nothing much. I mean, this is probably going to be a short little sh little show today. Well, I know that it's been brought up a couple of times on one of your favorite sites to check out this old drama, which has kind of stuck for the last month. Uh, well, I mean... Um, we could probably say it, right? What? The name of the website? Probably. I don't think there would be an issue with it. How SL Secrets? Virtual Secrets. Uh, virtual yeah. Secrets, yeah. Yeah. Well, I noticed yeah. that in December it was mostly about crabbing about creators, but uh, that's a whole different other story. I mean, yeah, I've got my issues with some certain things that are made, but other than that, I mean... Most of the stuff they complain about, I have nothing to do with, so. I know. You know. Well, the only thing that I've really noticed a couple of times I've gone out shopping and checking out the sales is, for the love of God, turn off your glossy on your avatar. <laughs> People are turning it to the max, and I don't know if it's just that they can't see it. Or that they just have really crappy computers, so when they put it on Max, now they can finally see it. You don't look attractive. What about their, um, what about these women with their physics turned up like crazily? Oh my goodness. Where they look like they're, you know, smacking themselves in the face with their boobs. Oh my god. Yeah. Or they come to a standstill and they're still moving. Yeah, like, about five minutes later, they're still yeah. jiggling, even if they turned off their AO. Yeah. Yep. 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 Basically. Although that just gives me a good giggle. <laughs> but, well, but they've also got HUDs out, which I've got one, because um, I wanted to see what it was like. But it actually animates, like, your butt or your boobs or whatever, even your thighs, mm -hmm. where they're constantly jiggling. <laughs> it, 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 it really doesn't look all that great. I thought maybe I could add a little extra butt wiggle to, you know, our dances. No, it still doesn't look right. So don't waste your time. So my next question to you is. Oh, what's that? Since we're making videos and posting them on YouTube. Mm -hmm. I mean, do you think I should stick with this kind of medium? Or, I mean, I thought about podcasting, but, you know, it's such a flooded thing. And, um, I mean, like I mentioned to you before, you know, you can do the same as Joe Rogan, where he does do the video, but then he also uploads the audio. Yeah, but I'm not recording the audio at the moment, so it's just a, it's just all one. I mean, I could take the audio out of this, but right. um, I don't know if I really want to go that direction. You know, it's just still up the air about it. I kind of find this to be... Uh, you know, a little bit better. Well, yeah, because we can at some point kind of do a tour once we get finished decorating, putting all kinds of stuff out around here. and Yeah. Show people around what this actual building is. Well, I mean, it's a, it's a pretty guitar. It's a flaming pinkish red guitar. So if you're watching this and not actually just listening to it, um, the logo behind JH's head. I'm assuming that's the way that you've got it pointed. As you can see, um, there I just brought yes. I just brought the map, so it'll probably show on the video that, yeah, 
there it is, right there on the center of the map. It so is that color, it is the bright, flaming, reddish pink guitar, and we are on Wooly Bear on mainland. Yep. So you can't miss us. We certainly show up on the map as we show. No, plus there's like uh, three rows that intersect all here. So, you know, if you're out pond riding, you can find this place. You'll go right by it and you go, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that's probably what a lot of people would have stopped in here. Kind of thought like, what the hell is that big flaming pink thing? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, it's because it's unique and nobody has one. So it's what makes it even better. Well, no, no one else has it because only you do. Yep. You built it. Yeah, I did build it. Uh, so yeah. Anyways, we we like to get more people in here to uh, have some discussion with, see what kind of input we get for anything like that. Maybe we could try some of one of our frequent visitors on Discord. Yeah. You know, maybe uh, try to get him in here and see yeah. if he's up for that. Even though uh, I don't have a chair big enough for his Avi. You know. <laughs> well, he can either sit on the ground like he normally does at the club. Yeah. Or, I don't know. Maybe we can find something. Maybe I can make something. Who knows? Well, I can always just put it out another microphone and just move the chair out of the way. And he can yeah. squat on the floor like he normally does. So, yeah. That kind of works. Yep. All right. So, we should call this a night and let everybody take a spill at that and hopefully you get some input and uh, this will be all posted on YouTube here shortly and um, yeah if you want you can get a hold of us uh, our, everything will be listed in the description and um, we'll go from there so uh, any last words there or anything else um, no not really it's got the cold TPs Oh yeah, the cold TPs. Relationship. Don't be a douche. It's just TP one. <laughs> and not the other. Really bad. Yeah, don't don't do that. It looks really bad, especially on you. Yeah. All right. So that's it for episode number two, and um, I think we'll probably do another one later in the week because uh, I'm there's a lot of things going on, a lot of a lot of drama to find out for tonight and shit that will probably need to be addressed and just stuff to talk about so I'll probably do it later in the week I don't know maybe Saturday again we'll have to see how my Saturday goes yep. I got a busy Saturday so yeah yep. if not um, yep I DJ a couple of places and um, yep if you come here you'll see the calendar boards up out front and you can find out where I am and uh Yep, now we'll go from there. Till uh till the next time, we'll see you later. <laughs>